Uh, well, there are uh, players dito sa Commissioner's Cup uh, na seem to be benefiting no, from the arrival of uh, big imports. Some locals sometimes their their performance suffers, but not Cyrus Baguio. Cyrus is soaring again. Why? Uh, yung bagong run and gun system na itong Alaska uh -huh. really benefits. Kilala naman natin ito si Baguio. Back in the day nung naka-coach Yang pa siya, all the way nung nag-national team to, dun talaga he thrives in open court situations and uh, parang medyo free-flowing free offenses. Uh, for a while, nung, well, lalo-lalo na the last conference, Charles, Cyrus was not playing that Super well. Super quiet. Oh, di ba? Parang uh, struggling siya. What's the difference? Honestly, one thing people will probably be overlooking is that the fact that he was actually playing hurt last conference. I think he came from an MCL surgery, or maybe I don't know if he was operated on. But because I remember I was with him once, we were doing some charity in giving gifts, and I asked him if there was anything wrong, how he was adjusting with the new coach. But he said that you know he, he was still really bothered by his knee, that's why he couldn't really play that long. But now he looks to be you know, fresh, and like what Magu said, the they change their sets a lot, they're playing more free, free flowing, he's getting to run, he, on transition, he's, he's just taking everything and he's making even long contested jumpers, he's just playing with so much confidence right now. Uh, Miyaka, ito yung mga numbers ni Cyrus, 21 points per game, 51% from the field, 56% from Rainbow Country. Parang feeling ko kasi malaki yung naging weight off sa kanya nung dumating yung 7-footer na lang si Adam Parada. Kasi usually, pag sinabi mong Alaska, siya, siya lang yung iisipin mong nagsuscore doon and si Sunny Thos. But now, I guess, parang uh, mas iniisip niya siguro na oh, wala na masyadong pressure sa akin. So, sa iba naman. Sa iba naman. Lahat ng, at, lahat ng attention ngayon, I think, goes to Adam Parada and Sunny Thos. So, na mas naiiwan siya out in the open. Uh, how greatly is Cyrus benefiting from an import like Adam Parada? Um, Parada, 7-footer, monster rebounder. Ano eh, mabadalas kayo makikita mo nag-leak out ito si Cyrus Baguio. Talagang, uh, pag, alam mo may vacuum kami, 7-footer ka doon sa ilalim pag guha na rebound. Leak out ka lang pag nahanap ka, sigurado makaka-easy to ka na sa kabilang dulo. And pati sa outside shooting, 56% shooting from the 3-point line. Eh, alam mo, kahit mag-mintis ka, meron ka rebounder sa ilalim, siguro mas waganda talaga sa kanya. Yeah, because uh, right now, they're parading Sunny Thos and Parada as their starting power forward and center. And it's probably the biggest in the league, I'd say. And that allows them to get more rebounds, which, like what Magu said, allows Cyrus to run more. Plus, they're playing a lot of stretches so, with... Na <laughs> Nakaterno kasi kami, kaya, you know, we have a connection today. But, but, you know, may connection kayong dalawa. <laughs> but they're... Nalagyan mo na naman mali siya eh. <laughs> but, you know, they're, they're playing a lot with LA, Bonbon bon Custodio, and Cyrus Bag, you know. That's a team that, like, I mean, really will push the pace. And LA is such a great point guard. He's gonna set Cyrus up. Then Parada, he's being doubled on the post. He kicks it out to Cyrus and, you know, he'll have a lot of open shots. Ayan, so totally, ikaw na nag-bring up, no? Uh, we have to talk about Baguio in the context of being in the same backcourt as L.A. Tenorius, one of the best point guards in the league. When Baguio's playing this well, uh, yung Alaska backcourt, what can you say about it? It's, it's when it become a very, very dangerous backcourt. L.A., mag nagkakaroon siya ng favorite on target and he can just pick his spots now. Yung uh, pagdating sa scoring load, nakita mo yung Lucena game. Baguio, 29 puntos sa 29 points uh, scattered all throughout the game. Pero pagdating ng dulo, defenses were really keeping an eye on Baguio na, dinitikita na siya. It was time for LA to shine. 19 seconds, 7 points ang binanat ni LA doon. Nalilibre na si LA doon eh, because of the attention that has to be given to Baguio. So, would you consider, now that Baguio is playing so well, 21 points per game, LA has always played well. Yung backcourt na yan, Cyrus LA. Should people consider this backcourt? Dangerous. One of the elite backcourts in the PBA. Not only are they super bilis, pero sobrang dangerous din. Meron potential. They're super bilis. May potential. <laughs> really? Uh -huh. Dangerous, ha? Dangerous. <laughs> really? May ikaw, potential. ikaw. Uh, okay, from a coach's standpoint, how how do you look at this backcourt? How do you defend them? What are their strengths? What are their weaknesses? Mm, no doubt, they're one of the elite backcourts in the league. L.A., you know, when he plays the pick and roll, he's just so tough to guard. Then Cyrus, you have to stop him in the open court because, you know, he'll, he'll finish one-on-one. -on -one, there's no way. So, you know, they're really going to be the focal point of the defense. But the thing is, you can't take their big guys for granted also because, you know, Thos, Parada, they're great players. I honestly think 
Alaska has a very good lineup this conference, and I think they'll go very far. But you know, I can't tell you what we plan to, to do Why against. Why not? Tay tay lang naman nandito. Bakak ba? Eh, kote lang. Yung ano? Yung alam naman ng lahat. Yung 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 Tos and Eman. Pinadala sa stage, like big man cancel. Yeah, so, okay. Now, so, let's go back to uh, Baguio just to wrap it up. Uh, do you expect Cyrus to sustain this all the way till the end of the Commissioner's Cup? I think he will scoring-wise, although I'm not too sure he'll be able to continuously shoot 56% from the three-point line. So, yeah. So, yun. Uh, Alaska with Parada and now with Baguio playing this well, uh, they should uh, look forward to uh, better games.